If you pick a random spot on a map of Alberta, you're more likely than not to find a tree. 60% of the province is covered in forest, and even with Canada being one of the world's largest forestry exporters, our global impact isn't just about what we can produce, it's also about what we can remove. Bioenergy with Carbon Capture and Storage, or BEX, is one of many tools in our Carbon Dioxide Removal Toolbox. BEX involves using forestry residuals and other low-grade wood fiber, converting these residuals and other forms of biomass into energy, then capturing and storing the carbon released in the process. This makes it a form of carbon dioxide removal, the only one that produces clean energy. Canada, and in particular the province of Alberta, is among the best places in the world to advance BEX as a carbon removal solution for the planet. Let's break down why. First, our forest resources. Forests are nature's carbon capture tool, and Alberta has a lot of trees. Forestry operations in Alberta aim to mimic the natural forestry cycle. 100 million trees a year are planted in Alberta as part of forestry operations in the province. More than 80% of our forests have international sustainable forest management certifications. And when trees are harvested, the industry puts in place a 200-year plan to ensure sustainable regrowth. Alberta's forestry, pulp and paper, and solid wood products industries are already working closely with Emissions Reduction Alberta and Alberta Innovates on a well-rounded portfolio of innovation projects. From tree planting drones to energy recovery in pulp mills, ERA and Alberta Innovates have funded transformative projects to advance cutting-edge technology in the forestry sector. Next, our carbon management framework. Alberta also has the necessary ingredients for large-scale CO2 storage underground. Our province has the necessary geology for long-term carbon storage. And building on our experience from the oil and gas sector, we have the regulatory framework that allows companies to use it. The Government of Alberta's Technology, Innovation and Emissions Reduction Framework, also known as TIER, provides a solid financial basis for investing in emissions-reducing technologies in this province. We also have commercial scale carbon capture, utilization, and storage infrastructure in operation, including carbon capture and storage projects and pipeline infrastructure for transporting captured CO2 to permanent underground sequestration via the Alberta Carbon Trunk Line. The province has invested more than $2 billion in commercial CCUS projects to date. It has incentives like the ACIP program in place for commercial scale carbon capture projects, in addition to federal incentives like the investment tax credit. And finally, our electricity grid. The big promise of BEX is the electricity and heat generated to power the carbon capture process with excess power exported to the grid. Alberta has a deregulated electricity market that allows for new entrants. Many pulp mills here already send extra electricity to the grid, so bioelectricity is already a proven part of our electricity market with room to expand. ERA and Alberta Innovate's prior investments in forestry projects, carbon capture, utilization and storage, and bioenergy have built connections and laid the foundations for BEX to be successful in Alberta and ultimately across Canada. Projects like Mercer's Fiber Procurement Project and Alberta Pacific's Craft Pulp Mill Flue Gas Recovery Project are helping the forestry sector increase access to sustainable feedstock and grow clean energy production. When it comes to BEX, ERA is supporting projects like Torchlight Bioresources and Vault's Rocky Mountain Carbon Project and Pharma Energy's Waste to Energy Partnership with the City of Edmonton. Good forestry practices, carbon capture and storage expertise, and an electricity market that's ready and adaptable. Alberta is a good place to invest in BEX.